Hello, I'm Emily Spaven. This is your Week in Tech. This week we're filming from WeWork Old Street, a co-working space in the heart of Tech City. In investment news, AppSumer closed a $1 million seed round led by Galvanize Capital. The firm plans to use the funds to develop its user acquisition intelligence platform for apps. London-based Finimize raised £450,000 in a seed round led by Passion Capital. The startup aims to help young people take control of their finances. Zapnito raised £442,000 from a group of investors. The firm's platform enables organisations to share, promote and monetize collective expertise. Despite a petition gaining over 134,000 signatures, the Queen signed the Investigatory Powers Bill into law this week. The controversial bill requires internet service providers to keep a record of all the websites visited by UK citizens for 12 months. Overseas, payments provider Stripe has raised $150 million in a Series C round. Led by Capital G and General Catalyst, the round puts the San Francisco-based firm at a total valuation of over $9 billion. Our download of the week is Mush. The Tinder-style app helps local mums to connect, chat and organise playdates. The app also features a messaging service and Mush guides to help mums through the daily challenges of being a parent. And finally, this week's drop in temperature is a reminder that the festive season is upon us. If you want to get into the Christmas spirit, Neural Karaoke can help with that. The AI programme will take any digital photo and turn it into a computer-generated sing-along. Move over, Mariah. That's all for this week's episode of The Week in Tech. For more technology news, visit techcitynews.com and follow us on Twitter. Thank you.